The Chabrette limousine, today called the mirrored Chabrette limousine because of the mirrors on its case, is an instrument that was found, or rather rediscovered in the 1970s and the 20th century. It was widely played throughout the limousine in Perigord regions. It dates back to at least the 18th or 17th century and is similar to instruments described during the Renaissance. The chabrette is clearly an intricate instrument with a very technical and highly complex composition. However, it is also an instrument that was widely played, particularly in the 19th and 20th centuries at least, by the working class, by ordinary people, to accompany dancing. People adopted these instruments as their own, adapted them, played them. And it's also touching to see the music that was played on these instruments back then. The instruments found around saint Irier looked different than other chabrettes, like this model, for example, with this type of case and this type of design, and with these types of moldings and designs on the large drone, the marquetry, the bone and horn inlay, and the tin. Many instruments were found that have a different appearance, but that are nevertheless part of the Chabrette family. The Chabrette is a large family with various sounds and appearances. But the distinctive feature of this type of bagpipe, as with many others, is the drone. The drone offers a particular musical element that puts you in a certain sound universe. The Chabrette-related musical repertoire that we know was created by three musicians who were still alive when the instrument was rediscovered in the 1970s. They gave us a repertoire that is similar to that of other popular musicians from the region. Various instruments were used in folk music, but most of the time, for utilitarian music such as ballroom music, there were many dance tunes, French folk dances, polkas, mazurkas and so on. Utilitarian music was also played during celebrations as street music, particularly wedding songs and marches, and other types of songs too. There were also popular hymns such as Christmas carols and songs like the one we played earlier, a réveillé. Réveillés are hymns sung at Easter time. All these are part of the repertoire that came to us through popular tradition. Then we noticed that this instrument has a much older history, one linked to music with written traces, including polyphonic music, for instance, polyphonic dances from the 16th, 17th centuries, and even music from the so-called Baroque period. Chabrettes can be played together with other instruments, of course. It's an instrument that is widely played both on its own and as part of a duet, like we did with Jean Marc. It's an instrument that works very, very well with the violin, but also other instruments such as the fife, the hurdy-gurdy, the diatonic accordion, but also songs for dulcians and the Renaissance bassoon, they work very well together too. So all this music is now being recovered, revived. We are inventing new forms of it, forms that have not been historically verified. We play with friends, with the instruments they play. We combine instruments and see if it works.